Okay, so uh, I was working as a clinician on the clinical desk in Banstead. Uh, Sarah phoned me up for some advice for a gentleman she was with uh, who was in a residential home for, t uh, with, for terminal care. Poor gentleman was in pain, uh, uncomfortable, lonely, scared and uh, Sarah, although she was due to finish in a very short period of time, first of all she she didn't even need to phone for any help. She could have quite easily have called for backup. Ambulance probably would have been there in five minutes. Gentleman would have been in the hospital in 10 or 15 minutes. And he, there he would have been in the, in the main department, left alone probably to die. Just unfortunately because there's not enough people to stay with people. So the first thing that she did that was, that was really great was the fact that she phoned up and saw if she could do anything else. Uh, I just I was just there to support her really, give her phone numbers. She then found out that the gentleman had medication there that hadn't been given to him, and she just basically she she cared for him. She cared for him in the way that perhaps the nursing home staff should have done, but that's no detriment on them. That's they're probably short staffed. She made sure that he was pain free, that she had her hand there so she could hold his hand to make sure that he knew that he wasn't alone and he wasn't scared. For whatever reason, his family couldn't be there. So for that moment, she, she was his family for that moment. And so he, as I found out sort of subsequently, he passed away. But when he passed away, he was pain free. He probably wasn't scared. And he had Sarah's hand to hold. And that was the reason for me nominating her because you know, if I was there on the road, I would have liked to have thought that I would have done exactly the same thing and I would be able to do the same thing. And this is the thing that people need to understand about paramedics is that we, we do, we're there for our patients and we are incredibly professional and we love what we do for that reason. I'm really pleased I nominated Sarah for this award uh, because she makes uh, me and I'm sure the rest of the service feel really proud through her professionalism in treating and dealing with this patient the way that she did.